everybody, I'm Kyle Bossman. I'm Liz Holmes. And this is the first 15. This is a show where we go in the Game Trailers Library, pick out a game for 15 minutes that we've never played before, and we give it a shot. Oh no, it's locked. Guess you gotta tell it a joke. Okay, um... What did the hallway say to the library entrance? You're adorable. Jiggles and giggles. Let's get in here. <laughs> Does my hair look stupid? Is it uh, doing this? It is doing this. It's always doing You gotta warn me when it does that. You look that. normal. You look Ugh. like where you always look. So, uh, unexpected episode of First 15. We're here. We're doing it. We're picking out a game we've never played before. And at least... How often do you get to come to the Game Trailers Library? Never. Is this what Springsteen wrote Glory Days about? Maybe. What kind of game should we pick out today? <sighs> you know, I like silly games. I like fun games. Okay. Uh... I cheated when I walked in here because I already I looked at one and I already have it in my sight. Let's look at it. What did okay. you cheat on? Which one? I'm thinking Superman Returns. So Xbox 360. Master your superpowers to save Metropolis. There's what what we call in the first 15 are some easy targets. I'm afraid this one might be an easy target. <laughs> what? This is the Brandon Roth. Roth? Ruth Superman. I think uh, Roth. Nobody gave him a shot. There's an episode of Making the Band, uh, Diddy's show, where he was making a, a hip-hop group that I always think of, I think of it frequently. He was describing how he refused, he, there, was a, there was like a really talented person who came up early, and he refused to let that person in. And his justification was, if you're going to the club, and all the women are pretty, you can't take that woman home, because you gotta wait and see who else is coming to the club that night. I think we can't take this. I think we can't take this home yet. I think we have to at least consider the other games in the library. It was too pretty. Is do you keep a physical pile of maybes? No, I usually walk around with it in my okay. hands. Okay. Like we have to find something better than Superman. No, you're not going to find it. Oh, so you're not, I'm, I'm not a detective at all. I just all these movie adaptations are speaking to me. We got Charlie's Angels here. And not too far away, Catwoman. Oh man. Do we need to come to a consensus on what it is? I guess we do. Normally what happens is Huber bullies me into a game. <laughs> He'll like pick one up and then bully me into picking that one. So I'm used to it, basically. Night at the Museum Battle of the Smithsonian. Great episode with Brandon Jones. Ah, oh, damn it! Damn it! Let's let's not learn from Diddy. Let's it's... we found a pretty girl at the club. Let's take her home, <laughs> right? Like why why wait? I guess. Let's do it. We're taking Superman Returns home. Okay, so once you hit new game, I'm gonna hit start the timer. Okay. So skip this though, we don't need this. This is first 15. We don't need that stuff. So this is the one, Superman was off in space, right? Yeah, I think, was he brooding off in space? He was brooding off in space. Three, two, one, go. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Loading screen, we're in space. So Superman is brooding. He's, I think he's brooding in space. He's hanging out in some kind of asteroid belt, maybe. Is this part of the movie where the rocks are blue and red? I don't remember any of the movie. Was that a thing? Is it's definitely a Superman thing. There's Clark Kent. Okay. He sees the the asteroid belt. What do you think about superhero costumes that have like like realistic stitching on them? Like you can see the stitching? Yeah, like his S looks realistic to me. Oh, we're in! Oh, whoa! Whoa! But no... This cape! Look how cool your cape is! With no indication of what we should be doing here. That was all right. Well, let's jump. I can't. Oh, because he's talking right now. What's wrong? Superman, you should not be walking on the streets, dude. Superman, tell us where to go. Oh. Okay. On Earth, you'll have the ability to defy gravity. On Earth, you'll have the ability to defy gravity. So does he not, on Krypton, he doesn't, he can't defy gravity? No, because don't they exist in their own gravity? Like, I, I feel like, isn't the, the Superman thing that like on Krypton, they are just regular, yeah, normal? Yeah, it's, it's Earth's sun that juices yeah. him, I feel like. Can we go to the top of this building up here? Sorry, my power dropped. 
but I'll go you back up. Power I'll, I'll, drops. I'll go back up. Okay, top of which building? Uh, the top of the tallest building is really what I'm interested in right now. The G, top of the G building. What is the G for, you think? Good question, I'm not oh. on top, oh. So here they come, here's the blue and red rocks. I have to stop them, Kyle. Can we go to the top of the G building first and then just... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm still aiming for that, the city can wait. Here we go, G. Oh, oh man. Senses will alert you to those in danger. I'm okay. in danger of not getting in this G right now. Okay, here we go. Playing this game as it was meant to be played. Oh, there's okay, a little, little helipad here. There. Those yeah. are nice. Can we land on it? Power drop. Yeah, power drop on that <laughs> shit. All right, here we go. All right, use care. Wait, what did that? Wait, I didn't it read disappeared. It. I think it was telling us not to wreck stuff. Oh. Yo, hit this blimp. I'm mad that it would do that. <laughs> Let's try to land on the blimp. Oh, shit. Oh, power drop. I thought that I could, I thought that I could like, uh, kind of, I, I want to power more I know, like upward. boost, like yeah, a speed I boost. I feel like this blimp is going faster. How about like a trigger? Oh, he just recoils. Oh, okay. Left trigger is recoil. It is like a real Superman recoil Whoa. too. I think you're catching up to that blimp. No, this blimp is going remarkably fast, faster than any blimp should reason. I can't catch it. You can catch it, you're gaining on it. There's an invisible wall in this blimp, Kyle. You're gaining it's on not, the blimp. Look, look. I feel like you're gaining on it. I'm. You're getting closer, you're in the blimp. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, you got a power drop on this blimp. You're right. This is great. Oh, went through it. Keep going. Don't stop the power <laughs> drop. This is cool. Drop it like it's hot. Boom. That was a good drop. All right, here we go. And what is this little side city? Oh, this is the industrial park. I wish I had some like mid-air speed boost. I'm sure we gotta unlock it. They'll tell us with the crystals. They'll reward us. Um, they just want to reward us for our playtime. So right now, we're, our objective is to head over to the super hearing icon. This kind of stuff bums me out in the first 15 minutes. I was so excited they gave us a city to patrol, and then immediately it's like, go here and do yeah. nothing else. We saw, we saw none of the city. Like, yeah. you would think that we would have experienced a little bit of common metropolis city life. Give us a little cutscene. Give us a little cutscene. Don't just show Clark Kent looking up without a funny saying. <laughs> Does Clark Kent have any funny sayings? Lois. Oh, golly. Oh, golly, Lois. We got some XP oh, for that. Good. Great. Oh, now the red rocks. Heat vision won't work on these. I need to catch it and prevent it from hitting the earth. Right, I mean, what does destroying it do once it's already hit? Oh, that's interesting. So, Super Hitman has a health bar, but so does the city. Oh, that's actually kind of a cool idea. No, it, I oh. guess so. This is my least favorite kind of thing in a game where it's like, your failure depends on the life of the city. All right, switch to super breath. What? Is this the thing? Yeah. That's actually, that's a real superpower. Why am I supposed to cast the super breath? I think on the side of this building over here. Oh, where the flames are actually in. Yeah. There we go. Coming in hot. So, I get the impression that we missed that part where Superman comes back from the brooding. Right. Because we saw Clark Kent just hanging out in the city like a normal man. Were we supposed to watch some that scene that we didn't, maybe. Maybe. Oh, that's a good map. Let's see, let's see this. Let's see how big the city gets. That's how big it gets, I guess. Okay. <laughs> oh. Metropolis. Okay, here we go. It's strange. Enough playing around, we got okay. stuff to do here. I'm sorry, you're right. We only got 15 minutes. Uh, it's just a weird city that it's like so tiered. Yeah. It kind of reminds me of Vancouver. But not even, look at this. This is crazy. I guess it's, it is at sea level. XP. Can I ask you a genuine oh, question? Yes. How do you feel about getting XP for this stuff? Uh, irrelevant. It is Superman. entirely irrelevant. It means nothing to me. Like Superman 
this means nothing to me. I yeah. don't care about humanity in this game, Kyle, and neither does Superman. That's a good point. They haven't given you a reason to care about humanity yet. But at least now we're... No, there it is. It's telling you, protect the city. <laughs> That's the thing. Do you know what I mean? A video game could tell you to protect a city without explicitly saying, protect the city. Well, he needs to give you a reason why that specific city. Why oh, here we go. We got our city? speed boost finally. Finally. There we go. Now we're talking. Ooh, there you go. You can finally get the ability to intercept. Whoa. Oh, he hit the blimp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's all right. I don't oh, mind that yeah. one bit. This couldn't have worked out better. So <laughs> Kyle, I love this city. If anything happens to this city, I don't know what I'm going to do. Because this city doesn't even appreciate you, I think is generally Superman's story. Right? Oh, God. Oh, I hope that blimp gets hit. <laughs> it's like, where's this endless supply of blimps coming from? Lex Luthor. Blimp magnet Lex Luthor. So those you gotta ice okay. vision. You gotta breath them. Okay. There we go. At the very least, Superman is grinding for XP right now. <laughs> city damage reduces Metropolis health. Thanks. Thanks. Thanks the Great up. tip. Great tip. Ugh, there's no way, Kyle. I, I'm not good enough at this game. <laughs> Why? They wanted to. They wanted to give us a big moment, and they did. Because you get to watch Metropolis die. So maybe you're supposed to fail here. It's like Bloodborne. That's a lot of XP. Thank God. He's Superman. What? What's XP gonna do for him? He's already. He's been through it all already yeah. at this point. Extinguish the. Oh. And I'm just a firefighter. Fire. Firefighter simulator. Yeah, can you use your ice beam against the fire? Or does it have to be breath? Oh, can you use the ice? Nice. That's kind of cool. At least they give me options. Yep. Thanks a million, Superman. Like, <laughs> what was that? <sighs> Ram the mega meteor to obliterate it. Okay. All right, it's right above you. I'm flying in this blimp. Okay. Oh. Little detour. There we go. Mega meteor. Ram it. <laughs> oh man, he looked so soft when he I like know. got ready for that ram. Whoa. He carries the weight of the city on his shoulders. Yeah. Ooh. Kryptonian, Kryptonian combination. combination. Subdue the mightiest with this long punch stream. You got a trophy. What is that you're doing? I, I'm just trying to do anything to make it go faster, really. Look at, look at. That's not good Superman posture. Putting the graphic on top of, of Superman on top of Superman. That's just foolish. Continue without saving. <laughs> and then he disappeared. And that's supposed to be Kevin Spacey's Lex Luthor. Yeah. And that's supposed to be, what's her face? I don't Lois know Lane. her name. What's her name? Oh. Um, I feel like she was in a surf movie. She was. Oh, look, they do. A, they put a statue above him. Not a Superman statue. Not Clark Kent, though. Oh, I see what you mean. That's just a, sta a statue of Brandon Ruth. Routh? Ruth? I don't know. I feel real good about Routh. I don't know why you stick with Ruth. I have no idea. Well, it's because it looks like Routh, so I think it is Ruth. It's the one that it, it looks like. It's not the one it looks like. It looks, it looks like South Routh. Yeah, so it is Ruth. It's got to be Ruth. Fortress of Solitude. We got picked up by a spaceship. No way. What is uh, this? What? This is good. Kate Bosworth. Bosworth. See, people say Bosworth. Uh-oh. Oh, no, no, no. I want to see at least where this goes. I mean, is there, can we not see it? Is that like a hard rule? Oh, yeah, yeah. We have to, you have to stop it now. Oh. You can't, this oh. is all against the rules. We can't see this. Oh, we shouldn't see this. You can't see there this. This go. is against, this is, we can't see this. Oh, I so want to see this. You can't do it. No. Oh. You can't can see any of this. It from, no, from you can't see this. Oh, I'm never gonna play this again. I'm not gonna know. Uh, can I tell you my guess of what that was? Yeah. Is we're about to get some limitations. So we can't be Superman in our entirety anymore because this guy picked us up. Was it Darkseid? Is that who that was? Uh, Let us know in the comments. Isn't it, I hate in games where it's like, hey, we have this superhero, this, this like all powerful hero. Let's take away all his powers. So yeah. that way you can't actually enjoy the powers of that hero. Do you know when the, uh, most, the most fun I had in this first 15 was going to the top of the G building. Me too. That was the most fun you could have in this game. 
and then it just kept interrupting it with stupid little tasks. <laughs> I, the, the, the blimp was not in, an active component of this game. Mm -hmm. The blimp meant nothing. Yeah, we, we peeked at the top of that G building. It was cool to watch the blimp explode, but it filled us with glee that I don't think the developers intended. No, no, I'm just glad that we, we hit that G spot. Oh, my feelings on Superman Returns. How do I process this? It's actually a lot of the same way I feel like an open world Spider-Man game. The important thing about being a hero is choosing to be a hero. Uh, in Superman, you're instructed to be a hero and there's nothing else you could do. It makes him actually less of a hero. Oh, we, we have no motivation. Yeah. We, we have no, I mean, I guess they're assuming that we know the backstory, which is kind of nice. They're not just feeding us an origin story, mm -hmm. but there's no motivation to save this city unless we know the, the in and out of the movie plot. Yeah, we're collecting EXP. Oh man, it didn't even matter. The, like by the time you finish the mission, you got enough XP just to finish off one level anyway. Yeah. One Superman level. You're Superman level two now. D graphics, I mean, I guess they're of the time. Graphics are of the time. Wait, what year is it? 2006. Oh. Of the time. That was 2006. I think this looked really good in 2006, probably. I guess. It didn't look bad today. But where it's contemporary. That was a huge city. Metropolis is such a big city. It, it was a city without character, though. Oh, yeah, big time. Lacking in character. Um, Vancouver has more character than Metropolis. We we wanted to know why that city was worth saving, and we didn't. Yeah, we didn't give that. us a reason. Um, 3.1. That's a 4. Some You know somebody sunk their heart and soul into Superman Returns the video game. Uh, maybe. I think that, honestly, it was probably a lot of people with a very tight deadline. I'm not sure there was a lot of... <laughs> you know what's funny? Uh, this is... It says $13 used. We don't have a lot of games in our library that were clearly bought at GameStop. Here's one. What was this needed for? What was it? Probably, like, top 10 worst superhero games. Yeah. <laughs> or maybe it was top 10 best. You can't tell with game trailers. No. 2006 <laughs> game trailers, you don't even know. Best list <laughs> yeah, right so not a best list. <laughs> Finally, all the powers of Superman. Bizarro is in this. I wish we saw him. Mm -hmm. I love Bizarro. I wish so many things. I wish we got to talk to Kate Bosworth. Let's hope that this never returns. 